While the funeral plans for Debbie Reynolds and Carrie Fisher are still being worked out, the funeral of another Hollywood legend, Zsa Zsa Gabor, took place amid an atmosphere of anger and controversy, with rival factions planning competing funeral services. People who attack me because of my wife's funeral, they are low, low, low. Lunatics. Prince Frederick von Anhalt, Zsa Zsa Gabor's husband of 35 years, is furious over accusations that he created a fraudulent list of celebrity guests for Zsa Zsa's funeral. A Hollywood publicist who claims to represent Zsa Zsa sent this cease and desist letter accusing von Anhalt of circulating names of stars who have no intention of attending. It claims Barbara Eden, Larry King, Carol Channing, George Hamilton and Quincy Jones are all demanding that their names be taken off the supposed guest list. It's been a difficult time for I Dream of Jeannie star Barbara Eden, who was friends with Debbie Reynolds, Carrie Fisher, and Zsa Zsa. I wasn't surprised with Zsa Zsa. I knew she'd been ill. I felt very sad. She was always so funny, you know, and sparkly and witty. The publicist, Edward Losey, is actually threatening to hold his own rival service for Zsa Zsa, a private alternative memorial for her real family friends. Frederick von Anhalt is the uh, king of fabricators. That's his real royal title. We're going to have, as an alternative for them not showing up today, a graveside memorial. It's going to be very small. Von Anhalt says he is outraged. If there's any chance, any uh, very small chance to file a criminal complaint against them, I will do it. And they are going to go down. Zsa Zsa was laid to rest today at Westwood Cemetery in Los Angeles, the same cemetery where Debbie Reynolds and Carrie Fisher will be buried.